do not buy sim cards or register sim cards outside the service provider's office so guys very dark man actually just revealed something very important that we all should be informed about we nigerians about a sim card fraud that's actually going on this is actually a matter that is of urgent importance which is very very important so that many people have been defrauded many people have actually fell victim of these things being uh, unknowingly being used as fraud so guys just watch this video and see what very dark man said about this particular matter let me pass an information that is important to a lot of people and uh, so that you guys will be careful do not do not buy SIM card or register SIM card outside the service provider's office. Do not buy SIM cards or register SIM cards outside the service provider's office. You know, so when you go all the service provider provider office, MTN, Glow, Airtel, and the rest, you go see some boys outside. They tell you to me, make a register one for you. Say if you don't buy Wi-Fi and hotspot and all those things, same they good one for you. You don't need to go inside. Do not patronize those boys. Now, if you notice, all the people that don't register SIM card outside the service provider's office, when you go to go register with those boys, when they snap you, after you get your details, when they snap you, they'll come tell you say, ah, say the team no save. They'll tell you say, ah, it did not save, the team wash. They'll call, they'll tell you may repeat your details, you go repeat your details. Do you understand? Then they'll go snap you again. Then they'll tell you say, ah, say now we don't go. During that time when they snap you and repeat that this that first time, that first time don't go to the service provider. But the second one, they don't save the details, they go use and register another SIM card. That other SIM card now, now they will come keep for cheer. Now they will come when you go to say, ah, you get a register SIM card, they go sell to you. Now when they sell to the person whereby register SIM card, possibly if you don't get luck, your details they go use and do terrorism. Do you understand? They go use your details to scam people. And when all this crime is done, they'll come come for you. When police start to the track, they'll go track the wrong person. The people that are usually victim of this is all those Alsa boys. Do you understand? All those Almajiri boys, all those Alsa boys, those Sulani boys. Do you understand? Plenty of them, 60%, 50% of them are usually victim. Then the remaining 20% are like every other person. Do you understand? So 80% of these people that register SIM card, they sell your data, they sell your NIN, because you put your NIN, you put your national identity number when you are registering your SIM card. So they sell your details, they sell your NIN to terrorists, and people have been saying that they into all this kidnapping package. Do you understand? So I will advise you, and I know why they tell you all these things. I will advise you, do not register your SIM card outside the service provider's office. Or you say you go to the market, you go to the key market, they sell SIM card there, you, you buy, you want to turn them as your permanent SIM card. Even if the line is long, even if the line is long for MCN office, Glow office, Etisala's office, uh, Etel office, everybody's office, make sure you stand on the queue. It is for your own good. Do you understand? And I know why they talk. Else, you people might learn, and you people might learn the hard way. I'm telling you for free now. Thank you very much. Now, notwithstanding, even the people where we say that they give this NIN, they have said that they are allegedly selling information to people where they install this kidnapping package. Well, I am privileged to assess some information. That's why I'm bringing it to the public. If not, like, one I know, yeah. By that time, you go down too late. Peace and love. Don't play.